Celebrating the holidays, but safely. The CDC says new guidance to help Americans navigate the weeks ahead after its first round of recommendations got a chilly reception. You might recall the CDC drew widespread criticism earlier this month after guidelines posted on its website again recommended virtual celebrations at outdoor gatherings. The agency later said those guidelines were outdated and quickly took them down. Dr. Frank McGeorge is here with a closer look at the new guidelines and how they differ. Doc. Yeah, Kimberly and Jason, so the new guidelines are much more practical and they acknowledge the fact that most American families are going to get together to celebrate this year. Now, the new focus is on reducing risk at your festivities, especially for the most vulnerable members of your family. We've just got to concentrating on continuing to get those numbers down and not try yeah. to jump ahead by weeks or months. After the CDC and Dr. Fauci were accused of party planning for the Grinch, the new guidelines paint a more festive yet cautious holiday season. No surprise, the top recommendation is to get vaccinated. It remains the most effective way to protect yourself and your loved ones. Now, for kids too young to be vaccinated, the CDC urges families to surround them with adults who are. Health officials also advise avoiding crowded, poorly ventilated spaces, wearing a mask in public indoor places if you're unvaccinated or if you're vaccinated but live in an area of high transmission, which right now includes Michigan, and getting tested if you have symptoms of COVID or have had close contact with someone who does. Also critical, if you are sick, don't host or attend a holiday gathering. The CDC still recommends not traveling if you're not fully vaccinated, but urges those who do to take extra precautions. While it's clear Americans will not be sitting this holiday season out, experts urge everyone to be realistic about the risks. Data is data. You can have whatever personal opinions you want. You can make whatever choice you want for your own health and your own body. But at this point in the pandemic, you're either going to get vaccinated or you're going to get COVID. That's where we are right now. Now, I think as you're making your holiday plans, it's really important for everyone to think about the people in your family. All of us have older relatives or those who have serious health problems, and you don't want to be the person who brought COVID to the party and infected them. Getting vaccinated, wearing masks around those people, or getting tested before a gathering can all help make those celebrations safer for the people that you care about. Yeah, so very important. Dr. McGeorge, are there any recommendations specifically for seniors or those with health problems? Well, you know, certainly you should get your booster dose just as soon as you can. If you're going to be gathering with people who may not be vaccinated or may have been traveling, wear your mask and take other precautions that you can. And if you don't feel safe about going, just skip it or speak up now. Right. It might just be the push that your family actually needs to get vaccinated. <laughs> so true. They don't want to be the first one to say something, but you should. Thank you for the tips, as always.